Right, so today's outfit is jeans. I didn't make jeans, um, but I did refashion the sweater, the sleeves. So I do have a video tutorial on how to do this technique and I'll put that in the description below. And I'm wearing the navy blue silver glasses, the frames are navy blue and the vents are also navy blue. And I've got my hair out, and this is the back. And I'm wearing this bag. And then I've got my sliders, wheels, and um, they're navy blue as well. Today's outfit, the top and the pants, I made them both. Uh, the top is many years old, the pants are probably about four or five years old, the top is a lot older. Um, yeah, it's off the shoulder top with this flower detail. I'm just going to show you. I'm pretty proud of that actually, it's quite cute, really nice. I've brooched it out the side, so I've just kind of got this use on effect that I like. And the sleeves are quite long. I like my sleeves to be really past my wrist. Um, yeah, a lot of my tops are like that, and I don't mind that. Um, so, yeah, so that is what I'm wearing today. Um, I've been the camera down so I can see my footwear, and this is how I'm going to team it. I haven't got any jewelry on. Um, I don't think it needs it. I did have a go and put a couple of bangles on. Like, no, it doesn't need it. I think it just needs to be simple because it's got a lot of detail, especially with the flower effect here. So I'm just going to be wearing some sunglasses and my bag. So these are the glasses. So those are the glasses. So these are green. It's got a green frame and black lens. And I'm going to clean it with this bag. So it's like kind of like a chocolate crocodile effect bag. And this is how I will be wearing it. This is my shoes. In the bag. got the like, straps and it goes in my bag. So yeah. The top for today is this gorgeous bathroom top. It's asymmetrical. So the other one is just a sleeve, setting sleeve. And that one setting sleeve. <laughs> anyway, I've had this top for I don't know how long. A lot of years. And the thing is, it's starting to. You can actually see it's been washed so many times because I love this stuff so much, but I haven't worn it for a couple of years or so because I just want to preserve it a little bit. So that when I do feel need to wear this top, then it kind of looks as though it hasn't been worn to death, but it has been between me and you. So, like I said, it's a bat wing and it's a sitting sleeve. It's my kind of style. It's asymmetrical, so it's brushed at the side, you know, the bit and it's just long on this side here. The pants are uh, wide leg pants or plasto pants and they have size C pockets in. So yeah, when I'm posing, um, this is where I pose with this one arm in one pocket. I do one tends to be revealed by that way, but by this side, but that doesn't matter. Um, I've got kitten heel shoes on. And yeah, that's it. And this is the bag that I would be sporting with the look as well. So I'll just show you the full outfit. Well, I'll my head as the usual, and so you can see how it's at the bottom. outfit and I'm very oatmeal kind of colour scheme going on so let's start with the shoes so I've got my kitten heel shoes on I wore these earlier on the week not yesterday 
length, three quarter length turn up pants. And a linen jacket. A linen jacket I have for a long while. So, and I just changed it up with some simple jewelry. So, the, this was actually a pair of earrings. Yeah. And so I just made it into a necklace. And they've got some earrings in as well, not matching. And yeah, and a bangle. So it's kind of like, like a bronze tone going on with my jewelry. And I teamed it with this kind of uh, very bulky kind of mini weekend bag if you like and you wear it over your arm like so and that is the look yeah just got to mention my glasses i've got to mention my glasses because i've got quite a huge collection of sunglasses so um, i've worn these earlier the week in the week and this the kind of like wood effect frames so i think that teams up nicely with the outfit that i'm wearing now this is the top i'm wearing for today cute bows cute bows so I am wearing white pants, yes I've made, and I refashioned this man's shirt. Now I do have a video tutorial on the shirt, so I'll leave a link in the description in case you're interested with doing a shirt with these cute bows. Now I'm teaming it with some necklace, my wrist, my neck, and these are pearls, I wish, and silver earrings. And you know me, I like my sunglasses. So I'm teaming it with these ones. These are my sunnies for today. So they're white frames and they've got a mirror effect to the lens. And you're gonna love this bag. How cute is that? That is such a fun, cute bag. I love this bag, I've had it many years as well. So yeah, and it's got a gorgeous handle, very strong handle. So this is how I will team it. And also, if I do get kind of fed up with it being in my hand, it's got a super long chain, a shoulder strap, so that I can put it in my shoulders and still show off my pretty bows. And it's a good length as well, as you can tell, it's super long, isn't it? Really super long. So that is going to be the look I'm sporting for today. This is the final outfit of the week. And I'm sure I'm allowed to film this even though I didn't make anything that I'm wearing. It's a jumper and it's super cool for winter. Winter, <laughs> summer. And um, it's, it's got lots of holes in it, so it allows your skin to breathe. It's a little bit windy, so that will be gorgeous. The sun's out. I think it's going to be out all day, hopefully, because it has been raining throughout the week. So I'm wearing it with white jeans, and I've just got a nice bra underneath. <laughs> and yeah, so that is what I'm sporting today. And also, I have a belt on it as well, so I've got a, like a, 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 a mammal print belt, black and white underneath. That's done on purpose as well, so that you can just about see it. So, you know, just playing around with illusions and ideas, because I was thinking about not putting the belt on, but it's like, you know what, I'm going to go for it. So I like that, because it, it kind of takes away from this area here as well, that like there's more interest that's happening within the top itself. So, um, let's see here, so, because it seems to be illuminating. Um, so yeah, uh, my sleeves are really long, and as you know, I'm, my sleeves are really, really long. So yeah, that's my outfit for today. I'm teaming it with a hint, a pop of black. So I've got black shoes on, and also, I'm going to tell you about my sunglasses. I've got two here. I'm not wearing both. So the first one is the black pair. Now, because I'm wearing black shoes and also my, my bag is also black, um, I was toying with the idea of whether I should wear my black glasses. Um, and it's like, you know, mm, no. So it's either black or white. And because I wanted the attention to be kind of 
all the way up and down and the glass, wearing black glasses kind of doesn't have a total look to the face area as well that I'm looking for. So I decided that on this occasion, but I would wear black glasses with, with what I'm wearing, but on this occasion I just want there to be white at the top, white here, white down the bottom, if that makes sense. So let me show you the difference between wearing the black glasses and wearing the white and then hopefully that will kind of explain without me using words what I'm trying to say. Do you see what I mean? It, it kind of like just makes the whole outfit pop because of the glass frames and my white brow underneath kind of, you know, you can just about see that. And then you've got the black belt, black and white belt that's underneath here that you can see. So pop, pop, pop. And then you've got my shoes. And I bring the camera back in the moment and my bag. So I've got this black wicker bag that I've been sporting with it and it's got a long strap. So it's it's at the right level that I want it to be. I don't want it to be up here. Because it will just, you know, if you had a short bag, it will just take away from the look that we're trying to create. So you want that look, yeah. And it's just its own thing while I'm walking, you know. So this wicked detail that's in the bag can carry it through the shoes that I'm wearing as well. So I'll spin the camera down so you can see my footwear along with my bag. So I just I just want to mention before I go that um, if you're interested in more of my outfits of the day and I, and I will upload it at the end of the week, more than likely on a Saturday, then please put that in the comments because I am quite enjoying dressing, you know, showing my, my wares that I wear during the day. So it's quite interesting that I can also share some tips and ideas about how to style, you know, some of the types of garments that, you know, you're probably wearing so um please put in the comment box below and let me know if you're interested in that and do give this a thumbs up and do share this video